XE is one of the most well-known brands in currency exchange. They are often the go-to website if you need to find the exchange rate between one currency and another. But they also offer international money transfer services. In this video, we're going to show you how to use them. We'll look at what you need to know about XE, what you need to make a transfer with them, and the steps involved in setting up an account and making that transfer. If you can stick around for the whole video, at the end we'll share our number one tip for making sure you get the best rate possible from XE. XE was founded in Canada in 1993, but began as just a currency converter. It has since grown globally and now helps more than 33,000 people make transfers internationally every year. They're also a really secure option. They're licensed with an Australian Financial Services license and they're regulated by the Australian Securities and Investment Commission. Okay, let's have a look at XE in a little bit more detail. The rate they will give you is generally better than what you would find from a bank and they don't charge a fee for making an international money transfer. Their website can seem confusing when you first look at it, but the process for setting up an account and making a transfer is pretty simple. They have toll free numbers throughout different countries that you can call and they're available for general advice within business hours. Keep a little bit of time up your sleeve because the transfer with XE could take a little bit longer than your bank. Now that we know more about XE, let's have a look at exactly what you need to make an international money transfer with them. When it comes to ID, XE generally only need your driver's license, but to be safe, have a couple of forms of ID with you. For payment, XE accept BPAY or bank transfer. So make sure you've got those details with you as well. It's important that you have the funds in your account. XE can't make the transfer until you've paid them and the funds have been cleared. Finally, make sure you do have time up your sleeve. It can take a few days for XE to complete the transfer. So it's important that you allow for this. Okay, that's everything you need to know. Let's jump straight into setting up an account with XE. To start, head straight to their website. You might recognize their homepage if you've ever looked up exchange rates for a currency. You can use their currency converter and choose the currency pair you need. This will show you the exchange rate between the currencies you selected. When you're ready to start setting up your account, head to the right hand side and select send money now. The next page has information about their personal and business accounts, as well as the currencies they offer and their rates and fees. To begin, click get started. The first step will be to inform XE of your country of residence and your email address. Fill these details in and press continue. Next up is your personal details. Make sure you fill in these details accurately for security and identification reasons. The next step is to create your password and memorable question. Make this password unique to any other passwords that you use. Now you'll fill in the nitty gritty details. Provide your address as it appears on your driver's license. Provide your main contact number, date of birth and nationality. The last part in this step is to accurately input your driver's license details. It's important that this is done correctly. You can then click next. The final step in the application process is to provide information about the types of transfers you'll be making. You'll estimate the amount of currency you'll transfer in the next 12 months, as well as the number of transfers and the country you'll be making the transfers from. The last question is how you heard about XE. Select the most relevant answer. Then you'll need to agree to their terms and conditions. You can find a link to these in the video's description. Then open your account. This is what your account looks like. You can set up recipients, orders and rate alerts. To start a transfer, select the currencies that you need, the amount and click new transfer. Now you'll fill in the recipient details, including their name, country, address and banking details. Click continue once you have filled in all of these details correctly. You'll then need to inform XE of your payment details. XE accept bank transfers and BPAY as payment. Once this is done, you'll confirm the rate and order. Once you have confirmed the transfer, you will be obligated to make payment to XE. And that's how you make an international money transfer with XE. If you have any more questions about the process or if something wasn't clear, just leave a comment below. So what's our tip for making sure you get the best exchange rate with XE? 
Well, while they don't charge an international transfer fee, they do put a margin on the exchange rate. This means that the rate you see on their homepage isn't actually the rate they give you for a transfer. Our tip is to use the link in the description below. This takes you to XE's website, but with this link, you'll have a slightly better exchange rate. Full disclosure, this link will give us a referral fee from XE, but it means that you get a better rate, which means that your money goes further when you make an international transfer. If this video was helpful, please like it. It would really help us out. And if you have any more questions, just leave them in the comments below. For more information about exchange rates, currency, international transfers, subscribe to our channel. If you have notifications turned on, you'll never miss it when we post something new.